Thanks for staying with us here on the Media News. Now, residents of Olodo community in Ibadan have appealed to the government of Oyo State to create an alternative route along the Ibadan Iwoshubu Road. This request comes after heavy rains destroyed the only bridge that connects the city to Iwo Oshun State. Olaido Iwole reports. The Sunday downpour thundered heavily across the country. Olodo community in Ibadan was not left out. But the devastating impact is what residents are now living with. Residents and travelers were left stranded and forced to trek through the dangerous terrain after the heavy rains washed away a significant portion of the major road, making it impassable. Though this is not the first time they will be encountering floods, this was different. This will be the second time or in this year that this thing will definitely happen and we what we are just asking the government to do for us is any means of palliative that we ease all this tension people have just been facing since the morning like now we cannot just go to work oh government should please be, for the sake of us especially the old men that are living at olodo olodo is almost, is almost a city so we want them to quickly help us Contractors working on the dual carriage road had begun construction of a new bridge on the other side of the road before the flood struck. The floods washed away most of the road, leaving only a narrow road for commuters to use. We need a bridge that is bigger, strong, more than this. That is what I'm seeing because very soon, very soon, I pray that we should not have we should not miss life. Oh. Chairman of the local government in his reaction says efforts would be made by the state government to ensure palliative and alternative routes to ease the burden. I want to appeal to the community that they should be patient and be calm in a very early period of time. The governor is going to look into a day. We are going to look for alternative route that will make a kind of succor to the people of this area. To this fisherman, the disaster seems to be a blessing in disguise. With the devastating impact that the rain has left on the people and commuters plying this road, their ultimate worry now is that how far, how soon and how swiftly will the government respond to this situation to ease their burdens. Olaidi Oyewale, TVC News, Ibadan.